that's interesting because I actually heard a similar story from Be Legit. Oh, Be Legit. And he was, I remember we had, him and I spoke at UC Berkeley. Uh, okay. It was like some Tupac class or something. Uh, and he was telling a story about how he was hanging out with Pac one night in LA. Mm -hmm. And I'm wondering if this is the same situation because it sounds so similar. And he said that uh, Mary J. Blige and, and Casey were arguing. You know, he made it sound like it was on the street or, or something of, of that. But they were well, arguing. I don't know they were arguing that, but I yeah, know. they're arguing. They and, and Pac pulls over, and he tells KC like to to chill out because Mary J. Blige gets around, and he had even been with her before, and not to stress out or you know, I mean, not, not to overreact over the situation because she's. Basically, yeah. for the streets, you know how you would say these days. Oh, okay. You know what I mean? But it was, he would say how like Pac just kept it a little too real sometimes. Like well, I'm wondering if this is the same situation or not. I can't say, but they had numerous uh, incidents because yeah. they both were drug users at the time or, or alcohol, um, yeah. and so they had a lot of issues at that time. And we talking about '95. She seemed to be a great woman now, a very uh, clean and. And so I have nothing but love. That's one of my favorite female artists. Oh yeah. So, but that that story happened. Uh, you have Danny Boy, who was sixteen at the time, who now, after listening to him on Art the Dialogue Show, I kind of believe that might have happened. All right. He said that he, he slept. slept with, he slept with Mary J. Blige when he was underage. When he was sixteen. But but I thought that Danny Boy was gay. Well, he wasn't gay. That hopefully. In 95, 94, when he was making the allegations. We're talking about 94, 95. And like I said, I don't know. Who knows? But he had, he had kids since then. Um, he had two kids since oh, yeah, I mean, 94, yeah, 95. So. Right, so he's probably bi. Yeah. Yeah. And I've, I've interviewed him before. You know, I, I think Danny Boy gives some of the best interviews out there. Yeah, he got the way emotional. He yeah, he yeah. cried at some point. You know, 